guys, I hope you're having a great magical morning where you are as I'm having a good magical quiet moment this morning where I am. I'm actually vlogging this in the morning and it's quiet here. Um, the kids are off at school and my husband is at work and it's just, it's quiet and I love mornings because they're quiet with the exception of the days that I got to go to work in the morning. but. I don't have to teach until this afternoon, so I have the whole morning to share with y'all. I recently made a purchase off of Amazon, and as you know, I am an Amazon shopper. I'm Amazon Prime, and I shop a lot on Amazon, and um, I just think it's a great way to do online shopping, and I'm usually pretty happy with the things that I order um, offline. With them so I want to share with you the candles that I bought we all know that I am a Yankee candle fan but I also like the LED candles um, only because I can put them in areas of my home put the knife down I can put them in areas of my home where you cannot put a you know a regular everyday you know candle um, for example, if I have, you know, um, these, for example, because I have this in my dining room. So I have like one of these pillars and I want to sit it on the floor near the fireplace or something like that. I would not necessarily put a real candle, you know, there because someone could accidentally tip it over, the dog could tip it over, and then I could have a fire on my hands. So I like to buy LED candles to where I can put them in areas, you know, where regular candles wouldn't go. You can stick them in bookshelves. I use them a lot for decorating around the house during the holiday season. And I picked up some new ones from Amazon and I'm going to leave the link down below to where you can pick these up on Amazon if you find that you like them. So we're gonna open them, check them out, and I'm gonna put batteries in them to make sure they work. And then I thought that I would even vlog this video at night. That way you can see what they look like at night too, rather than just during the day. And I would like to see how they look at night too. So we're gonna open this together. It's a hot, humid day here. You wouldn't think fall is around the corner the way the weather is here right now, but it is. And hopefully these work. So let me make sure everything's in here. Yep. So they look like this in the box. So they came like this in the box. And I got the Gideon LED LED flameless candles. And I got the three set, so they look like this. And they're made from real wax. So when I do have them by the uh, fireplace, um, when we have the fireplace running, I kind of have to sit them off to the side because we do have, you know, an electric gas fireplace. So meaning when I want the fireplace on, I just have to switch the light switch and boom, my fireplace pops on, which is really nice. But, um, it gets hot so I don't want these necessarily by the fireplace when the fireplace is on because it will melt these LED candles because they are made with real wax so I actually bought three of the um, set or I should say two of the three sets so I bought two of these and I will um, like I said I will open them and we'll talk about the size and the measurements and then I bought these should be the seven inches and yes, these should be the seven inches because that's what I ordered. I bought two of these and these require two double A batteries. Yes, it says seven inch candles. So these are the seven inches and then these require three double A batteries. So the sizes of these candles are the four inch, the five inch, and the six. And I'm thinking like, this must be the four, this must be the five, and this must be the six. And there is a glare in here, I'm sorry. The four, the five, and the six. So we're gonna go ahead and open these and make sure they work. So give me one second, okay? 
Good. Before I put the batteries in, I probably should show you how they came wrapped. That way, if you're somebody who's really interested in these after you've watched this video, then you will know how they came wrapped. So they came wrapped like this, and it looks like they came with this really nice cushion siding. Now this is the um, the flickering one. So as you can see, this on the inside, I don't know if you can tell, but that moves because it's supposed to give it a feeling of a real, you know, candle. So it did come with the remote, which is right here. So it did come with the remote. And I'm just going to unwrap it for y'all. And it is right here. And I'm going to go ahead and I don't, there, see how it kind of moves back and forth. I don't want to pull on it. But yes, they came wrapped. It seemed like very secure. So I'm going to go ahead and put batteries in these and we're going to see if these work. So I'm going to open up the three pack now where you get three candles in the box. And they came like this. So they came pretty star phoned wrapped up, which is great. So they just came like this with the instructions on top. Whoops, sorry. Like that. So they came styrofoam. And we will open them and see how they look. So they came in this nice styrofoam holder. And I don't want the remote to fall out, but at the top is the um, remote. And the remote, you don't need batteries for. You just need batteries for the candles. So these are a little different than the single candles and the fact that they have like a film on them, protective film. So I will have to take that off or slide that off or maybe it's supposed to stay on there. I don't know. No, it peels off. It's right here. It's just taped on there. So if you do order these candles, know that on the three pack, there is a protective film which is good to know. And guys, I forgot to mention, these smell. These smell. I promise you, when you get them, they smell. They have a vanilla scent to them. And um, I'm right now, I'm in my dining room doing this video, and the other two candles are in the kitchen counter. I set them there to make sure they're working. And I can... I can smell them a little bit, not a lot, but when I went to go put the other the, the other seven inch next to the other seven inch, as I was walking over there, I was like, oh my goodness, these candles really smell. So they definitely have a vanilla scent to them. So let me finish um, unboxing these and get the batteries in and we'll check them out together. Here are the candles. They are on right now and there's different there's different sets, um, settings for them. Um, each one came with its own remote, remote, meaning, you know, each set. So like this three set came with its own remote and then each seven inch candle came with its own remote and then the next three came with their remote. However, one remote will work them all. But I would suggest that if you're going to be putting these candles in multiple rooms, then you want to make sure that you have a remote for that um, room. But if they're pretty much going to be in the same vicinity, then one remote would definitely um, work for all of them. But I'm liking them. They are smelling good. Um, what I did want to show you was on the remote, um, if you decide that this is something like that you want to purchase on the remote, when you get it, um, there is a little tab that you have to pull out in order to activate the um, remote. And then I'm just going to kind of go over it really quick. So I'm trying to look here. Here you have a two hour setting, then you have a six hour setting, a four hour setting, and then an eight. And then of course you have your on off switch at the top and then you have your mode set and then you have your dimming, which is, um, you want a, you know, it to be really bright or you want it to be less um, light. And then as far as mode goes, you know, do you want more of a candling effect or do you want more of a light? Or no, this is candle right here says candle. And then this says light. So uh, if you're going to use it like as a night light style in the bathroom, then you may want light because light really brightens it up. And then that candle mode kind of sets that candle tone. So 
I'm gonna go down in the basement. We're gonna go downstairs in the basement in the dark so you can see these and how they kind of look at night, um, you know, in the dark. So, but I wanted to show you really quick how, let's turn this camera around, how it all comes together. So if I'm just gonna turn, whoops, sorry guys, my camera. If I am just going to turn them all off, I don't know if you just saw that. I gotta kind of point it. How would they just all flickered off? And then I'm just going to press, press, press the green button and they all are flickering back on and now they're all back on. So one remote can work on all candles. So let's head downstairs really quick so y'all can see how it looks in the dark. Hey guys, so I'm downstairs in the basement and I am filming these in the dark for you. So hopefully you can see them. I will kind of get a little bit closer for you. So they're like right there. That's how they're looking in the dark. I'm going to play with the remote a little bit to give y'all different options. So right now I'm just going to flick them off. So right now they're off. Over there is a night light in the wall. That's why you see a light over there. But now I'm going to go ahead and flick them on. Kind of makes me think of Haunted Mansion at Magic Kingdom Disney World. Here we go. Let's flick them on. I'm in the dark so I can't see. Okay, there we go. So I am going to dim them a little bit. I don't know if you can tell, but they are starting to go down on the dimming. I might have to get a little closer for that one candle over there. But I just started to dim them. Watch how I brighten them up. Do you see that? So it almost like it becomes a nightlight look how pretty the wall is flickering up there isn't that gorgeous i think that's so pretty so i hit the light button but i can still dim it i don't know if you can tell how it's getting darker it's getting way dark guys i don't know if y'all can tell the difference but there it got dark and then i'll hit the light button again and watch how it brightens up do you see and now I'll hit the candle button. I'm going to hit candle. Okay. And I'm going to dim them. Let me press so I could see what I'm doing. Okay. I'm going to dim, dim them. They're getting darker and darker. I don't know. It's kind of like I got to take the remote and I got to like point it to different areas. Did y'all see how dark that got? That is very romantic. And I just think it's so beautiful. So it's pretty much dimmed all the way down. And then if you want like a little bit of light, I'm gonna turn on a little bit of light down here in the basement because I have great lighting down here. This I'm in the multimedia room. But um, let's say you have light on. So let me just kind of turn on the light a little bit. So I have the light on now because we have, um, Good lighting down here for media room so that is just dim lights and then I'm going to put on dim them up a little bit more or brighten them up a little bit more so now I just brightened them up a little bit more in the basement I don't know if you can tell and then I'm gonna do it one more time all the way brighter there you go so now the lights are fully on as you can see, I love pillars. I have them throughout my home because I love candles, but I don't know. It makes me think of Haunted Mansion, but that's it guys. Those are my LED Gideon um, lights. I love them. Like I said, I got a uh, two seven inches and then I got a five inch, six inch and four. Let me see if I can zone in. So the one at the top there, that is the four inch. And then the one right below it there, that is the five. And then this one over here, right over here to the left is the six. So you have the four inch, the five inch, and then the six. And then of course down below you have a seven. 
And the seven and the six inch look almost the same. And it's only because of the pillars that I have them sitting on. But yeah, those are my Gideon lights. Guys, those are my Gideon LED flameless candles. And they're the flickering kind. I'll show you the box one more time. So they're right here. These are the three pack where you get a six inch, a five inch, and a four inch. And then down here, I have the seven inch. I really like the seven inches. Um, I like the way they seem to flicker. I don't know what it is, but I do like them and they have the wax dripping effect. I do like these also. I like these. These are great price point given that you get three and this was a pretty good price point also. So like I said, I will leave a link down below where I purchased these off of Amazon for both of these because they were purchased separately. And um, yeah. That's my Gideon LED. So let me know what y'all think by leaving some comments down below. If you have flameless candles in your house, I would love to know the brand that you have. Maybe you can recommend a brand that you are quite happy with to me. And um, if you like real candles also like me, feel free you know, to leave comments about those down below as well. But I love decorating my home during the fall season and um, Christmas season and actually anytime with, um, you know, fake candles because you can do so much more with home interior design with them. So if you liked this video, guys, give it a magical thumbs up. If you're not already a Life in Disney Mouseketeer, then feel free to hit that little subscribe button down below. So till next time, guys, y'all take care. Y'all have a magical day and a magical week, and I will see y'all later. Bye, guys.